the festival of the rains can now begin. This is Tej, bringing in the rains, celebrating companionship and lifelong bonds while still being a festival dedicated to women. A girl is addressing her friend that Tej has arrived, so we are going to dance in our courtyards. celebrated in every corner and every household in Rajasthan. You suddenly see, went out to the bazaar I went and I saw that there is a whole pile of ghevar and you know Tij is going to come, you know. <laughs> a land where you have festivals all along. In large number of cities, the spirit of festival is getting slightly lost. Mm -hmm. But in Rajasthan, you can see that gaiety around. You can see that exuberance. You can see people really, they're, they're vivacious and vibrant on these occasions. <laughs> On the one hand, you see these high-rise buildings, you see people racing uh, with time, moving around, high speed, etc. But at the same time, these traditional functions are observed with the same uh, spirit. If you live in Rajasthan, you see it all around. That's the way Rajasthan uh, continues to reflect the spirit of festival and gaiety. My feeling is that everything synchronizes. Weather, people's mood, their attire, their eatables, and their life, philosophy of life, their attitude towards life. So it's not so dismal in Rajasthan as its landscape is, but people really celebrate monsoon.